Howdy doody everybody, my name is Kev Gooey and welcome back to Nikopara. So, in the last episode, our two Nikos here were shipped away secretly. Come live with me. And now, I am telling them to put back the shampoo. You're a pen? We don't have any shampoo. Hmm. That's not, that's uh that's not a good thing. あの猫ちゃんたち、シャンプーもろくに買ってもらえないのかしら。かわいそうに。Hey. abuse. I, I all I said was to put back the shampoo. Don't put on some act to confuse the customers around us, seriously. Yeah, you two. Chocolate and vanilla. We'd only just moved here. Yeah, you're giving us a bad impression. Giving me a bad impression. But suddenly, we already had disapproving glares directed at us. Oh. No, oh, that's not good. <laughs> It is? Yay! Oh, it's adorable. Hey. Hey, I just... I need to save up money. Because, you know, I just moved out on my own. I'm not a cheapskate. Besides, I nearly got reported. Yeah, because of you two. After that, it was the same sort of exchange at the supermarket. The whole thing was so awkward that I don't think I can visit that shopping district for a while. That was a weird... I don't know why I said it like that. I think I was about to say long while. And there's a while. Well... I guess you could say that was the cute side of cat girls. Really? The cute side? Eh, maybe. What? What do you smell? Really? What? 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 It definitely does. What is this smell? I don't know. <sniffs> Knows I nothing. Are you tricking me? I turn towards the source of it. <gasps> Food stand cat. Oh, she's adorable. Oh, she's so cute. The kawaii. Oh, takoyaki! Of course the cat girls would love that, or would smell it. Bonito flakes? What is that? Wait, she seems kind of young to run, run a sh takoyaki shop by herself. Huh. Oh. It was a cat girl younger than chocolate and vanilla. Yeah. That, I, that was what I was seeing. She waved her tiny hands as she politely drew customers in. Aww. In human terms, she looked like she was about 12 or 13 years old. Really? 12 or 13? In cat years, she was about six months old. Whoa, jeez, six months? That's... Six months? 
Wow, that's a... Huh. The young cat girl noticed us and ran over. Aww. Aww, they sound so cute when they go meow meow. <laughs> Rub the neck. Wouldn't it be like patting the head or something? I don't know. Oh, where's your smile, Vanilla? Oh, there's your smile. Oh, see, and there's a pat on the head. Oh, who's that Ferris in the background? What? Your, your cat girl's not troubling us. Yes, I am. The owner of the food stand greeted us. Yes, I am. <laughs> Ah, oh, well, to be more exact, my little sister is their owner. Wait. If, if, this, if my sister is the owner, but they call me master, does that make me the owner? I'm not confused. They are. Aw, oh, thank you. Oh, seven months old. Gotcha. Aw, of course she will. The food stand owner had a wry smile on her face like she was talking about a mischievous child of hers. At a glance, it was understandable that seeing a young cat girl made it easy to overlook these things. Mine were originally strays, so I don't actually know how old they are. Oh. The veterinarian said that they were twins and were now about nine months old. Well, there. You, right, there. right there! Nine months old! My little sister is actually quite the education freak. Back then, they were really noisy, but it was all worth it. Oh, yes she did, I think. Oh, and you grew up to be good cat girls. But you have to be tough, so that you girls can learn a lot, you cat girls. Ah. Oh, see? Master is master. So I, so I am their master, slash owner. Oh. Ah. Uh, I guess so. Well, I am grateful. She lightly nudged me with her elbow. I responded with an embarrassed forced smile. Hearing this kind of stuff in public sure was embarrassing. Really? But that means you did a good job, right? Oh? Oh, rubbing the neck. Oh, you tricksters, you cat girls, you Nikos. Three of them were getting along very well. Aww. The food stand owner looked fondly at them from nearby. Really? Aww. Why would someone just throw out a... A, um, cat girl like that. Aww. Oh, that's good. 
Oh man, it's not so touching. I can see why, they're really cute and yeah, adorable. But. Really? Her words seemed tinged with blame and worry. Huh? She grumbled, letting out a sigh. Not that long ago, it wasn't rare to see stray humanoid cats just wandering throughout town. It wasn't rare? Why are people throwing out stray humanoid cats? But now, it was more likely for one to see humanoid cats that were well loved by their owners. Aww. Since the amount of unfortunate humanoid cats had decreased, there was more of a balance and owners were quite elated. Yeah. I mean, I'd, I'd be glad. I mean, that's so sad seeing a bunch of humanoid girl, you know, cat girls, um, being strays. Yeah, I'm disgusted too. That's a way to put it. Yeah, think of the positives. It was a bright and honest laugh. I nodded in agreement. That is true. This must be like how pets find their way back to their owners. What? That 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 has nothing to do with the strays. I smiled at such an uncharacteristic thought from me. I'm so kind of confused. Oh. What? Ooh. A big piece of octopus? Ooh. Well, I'm not a big fan of seafood though. But octopus does sound kind of yummy for some reason. I Maybe mean, it's the tentacles. Mmm. <laughs> Aww, that's irresponsible. Oh, Vanilla was like, she had that very understanding look and then she just looks sad now. Oh. Chocola and Vanilla's shoulders drooped down heartedly. Oh. As they hung their heads, I rubbed them from behind. I took a look at the little takoyaki seller. Okay, three orders of takoyaki. Can you do that for me? Takoyaki, mitsu? Wow, their, their ears just like perked up. <laughs> her large eyes blinked as she tilted her head in confusion. Yeah, for me, chocolate and vanilla. Could you do that for me? Yay! Oh, huh. uh, I thought she was just gonna back away all the way to the, the, the truck. Is that food truck then? Oh, she disappeared. <laughs> it's going to take time to get home and make food after all. Besides, I want to try the takoyaki here too. Ooh, yeah, the octopus. Ah, I'm glad I could make you happy, Chocola. Yeah. Wait, Sun Deer? Isn't Sun Deer a bad thing? Hmm. Wait, what does that mean? Oh. Alrighty. <gasps> Aw, thank you. Yeah, arigato. 
はマヨネーズかかってるのが好きです。Oh wow, she just straightforward like that. I want mayonnaise on them. ありがたくいただきます。ペコリ。私は明太子チーズがいい。Fish roll and cheese flavor. Hmm. My question was completely ignored. Well, I guess I shouldn't let it bother me, huh? Yeah, don't let it bother you. I wondered about that as I looked at chocolate and vanilla, happily awaiting their takoyaki in front of the food stand. Oh. Meow, meow, meow. Neko para. What's that? What's that sound? Huh. And I'm going to end the episode here, everybody. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. If you guys did, then please slime that like button and help support me by sharing this video and by subscribing down below. In the next episode, we will see if we can get a hold of our sister and see if we can send、um, chocolate and vanilla back. Because, you know, they hid away in the boxes and came to live with me. So, yeah. So, everyone, thank you for watching this episode, and you will hear me in the next one. Goodbye!